Okay. I have pushed record. Me too. I am recording as well. <coughs> Mr. Oh, I'm gay. <laughs> Hi, gay. I'm Gage. Do you want some snap your poop? Please, thank you. Did you know that? No. Yeah, please. Right there. It was upside down. Thank you. Oh, this is really good. Good Action. job. Okay. Every... <laughs> Don't distract me. Okay. <laughs> Three, two, one. That's too fucking well, loud. <laughs> Three, two, one. Where are my character sheets? Three, <laughs> two. Where are my character sheets? <laughs> They're in here. You should have thought this before. Well, they're, they're, they're in here. They're, they're in the front. They're, they're no, they're okay. like whatever. They're, like, they're right here. It's it's that one. Yeah. Funny shit, man. I understand. Okay, I am ready. Three, two, one. Nat twenty. Welcome back to a deal with demons. In our previous episode, Farron had met with. A Firbolg named Vazmir, mm-hmm. and he has agreed to travel with them and to fight a dragon with Vazmir. So they're on their way to Ait, and from there they'll look for a dragon in the mountains around there. Oh, hell yeah. And the rest of the crew are just on their way on the mountainous road to Ait, and they're going to stop off at the caves that uh, Blaze has been to before. So I'll start off with the rest of the crew here. So, is there anything specifically you're doing while you're traveling? Yeah, why don't you start off with me? No, I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going to abstain. I would really prefer we start with Fentanyl. Uh, I want to look for a wizard. <laughs> <laughs> just cast Detect Magic. Done. Just look with your eyes. Uh, I, yeah, I'm going to keep an eye out. I'm going to head towards this cave, but I also want to keep an eye out for a wizard, because apparently he's in the mountains. Is he yeah. wearing a pointy hat? Is his name Mr. Mithers? Oh well, yeah, is Mr. Mister here so we can kill? I mean, uh, defeat him and take his stuff. You don't see Mr. Mithers, <laughs> Mr. Mithers, or Mr. Misters, or any other wizards around. Well, darn. Gosh darn. That's Gosh gee fuck. That's, <laughs> That's not your voice. You're right. Gosh gee fuck. <laughs> There's no goddamn wizards in this mountain. Um, but yeah. Watch so, did we tell you about Mr. Misters and Mr. Mithers? No. no. Yeah, it's uh, so right, okay, so... Right. It's a secret. It'll be a secret. No, we, I'll just quickly explain it, just to keep them in the loop. Oh, okay. So, on the way to the lake, they found a cart and a wizard driving the cart named Mr. Misters. The cart was called Mr. Misters Mythical Mystics. I think so. Yeah, yeah. that's right. Either that Sounds or Mystical right. Mythics. Yeah. I think it was mystical mythics, mythics. Mythic and he mythics. sold like different uh, magic weapons or magic items and stuff. Oh, okay. They bought a few things that they can tell you about later. And before he left, he also told them to watch out for uh, another dude traveling in a cart named Mister Misters, mythical, mystical mythics. The other one was mythical. <laughs> we get it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I yeah. understand. <clears throat> we just gotta get the brother. Yeah, and uh, he said that Mr. Misters stole a bunch of items from Mr. Mithers, and Mr. Mithers wants the group to steal those items back from Mr. Misters. Not and not to kill Mr. Misters, because Mr. Mithers would not like that, but he's okay with you guys harming Mr. Misters. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm caught up. Yeah, Mithers wants us to kill Mr. Misters. Mithers, Mr. Misters, Mr. Misters. Mr. Misters. Mr. Uh, Mithers, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Mithers, mythical mythics. I am ready to move on. <laughs> um, while we're traveling the cart, I don't know anything. Because I don't care. You're not doing anything because you don't care. That's some good roleplay. <laughs> well, good job, man. Right, it's worse if I was the cave. I didn't want to go to the cave. So I'm just chilling in the back. Make the most of it. I feel that. I'm <laughs> Not doing anything right now. <laughs> oh, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll talk to Z, man. No, you already said you're doing nothing. Your role playing turns ah, over. I'm talking to Z, man. That's nothing. He's nothing. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking to him about? Um, nothing. <laughs> so, how many instruments do you know how to play? <laughs> uh, <that's okay. laughs> I'm best at the lute and mandolin. I'm decent at drums. Can play a bit of the harp. Uh, Can you play the sham? I don't know what a sham is. Kind of bar does know what a sham is. What is a sham? <laughs> it's a musical instrument. Like I, I actually don't know what a sham is. So. Uh, I heard <laughs> it's a shaman. 
It's, uh, it's a Renaissance wind instrument. Forerunner of the oboe with a double reed enclosed in a wooden mouthpiece and having a penetrating tone. Okay. Yeah, he doesn't know how to pick I'll show you a penetrating tone. Oh! Tome! <laughs> I can play the <laughs> I can play the flute a little bit, uh, the horn. It's mostly it. Nice. Can you play with emotions? <laughs> <laughs> Make me feel better. <laughs> I don't think you can do that. <laughs> Nothing can. <laughs> so what? Uh, what inspires you to write? The songs that you do. Well, like I said before, a lot of it is from the master. And I just get, like, the, these dreams of songs and lyrics that just come to me at night. Have you tried writing something yourself? <laughs> I used to write my all of my songs myself. I still write a few of myself, but the ones I wrote a long time ago are never hits or no one ever likes them, so. Have you, uh... Wrote a song about police. <laughs> well, I've uh, apparently the songs I've written are of all of you guys. This is the guy we found at the party thing, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. I just trying to figure it out this whole <laughs> time. <laughs> <laughs> it's been like six hours. <laughs> I've tried to think so hard about it. Um. Cool. Uh. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's okay. It. I just. Nice. Small talk. Yeah. Okay, uh, if there's nothing else anyone wants to do right now, I'll go to, to you, Baron. Uh, so you're still traveling with Vasmir. Uh, you've traveled about half a day's worth now. Mm-hmm. Uh, the sun is still up. It's on its way down, though, now. Uh, you believe that it'll still be another day's uh, walk to Ike. How's, uh, how's the blizzard? How's the weather? There's no snow anymore right oh, now God. coming down. There's still snow on the path and like on all the mountains and stuff, but none coming down at the moment. Okay, I'm still keeping that bear pelt. Yeah, it's still pretty brisk out. And along the way, you don't really see many animals at all. Like every once in a while, you might see like a mountain goat, maybe off in the distance, or or a bear or something. But that's really all you see. <sighs> You know, the wildlife around here is pretty spruce. Spruce. <laughs> 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 the <laughs> the bear. Uh, These trees, man, they're pretty uh, spruce. <laughs> we might, I might, we might. Well, the, the area might need you just to turn into an animal and you know mate with one of the other ones. <laughs> really get the wildlife back up. That's and not something life. that I would. <laughs> Please turn into a furry. <laughs> we don't. <laughs> I don't know, it's just a thought. I just noticed. Baron really wants you to fuck that goat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's a goat over there. There are enough beyond this pass and beyond the other mountains that they'll survive. Okay. And I no longer like you. <laughs> <laughs> just worries, you know, I care about wildlife very much. There's a lot hibernating and staying in their homes for a long time. Oh, good, good. Well, the weather's cleared up. That's good. <laughs> wow, two awkward conversations. Yeah. Uh, Very, yes. Dude. Just make him do it. <laughs> where, where, where do you come from again? I oh, have changed this guy's voice again. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. I come from a land down under. Or oh, Australia. <laughs> yeah. Fuck, that place is dangerous. It's an yeah. unknown place. Uh, like, is there a name for it, or? No. Um, most people just refer to it as the land down under. So how do you come to be here, besides your traveling to the mountain? Well, see, it's boring. It's really boring, like, this conversation. (laughs) (laughs) Fuck, man, (laughs) role-playing. So good, So good. So about ha- so about a day more, day longer. Yeah, it should be about a- another day's worth of walking. Oh good, oh good. Anything oh, cool to see along the way, like m- monuments or statues or? 
I, I don't think so. It's mostly just a straight path from here to right. Ah. Dude, just teleport out of there. <laughs> just bail. Oh, well. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'll go back to you guys now. <laughs> Baron was also yeah. born. <laughs> Have we reached the cave? I don't know. You. Of wonders! Aren't you driving? I was speaking. You're right, I shouldn't have used my character. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anything you guys want to do on the road before I just say we make the games? I was thinking we should probably have a few more awkward conversations. <laughs> let's not. Let's <laughs> no, let's just argue just... for another like 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> are, we, are we finally like heading up the path towards the cave? Are we yes. there yet? I already <laughs> had my mental breakdown last episode, so. So, Blaze, you do know that now you are pretty close to the mountain where the cave is. We're so close, I can smell it. I think it's just you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Burn. Uh, you, from your memory, you remember there's not a great path, so you probably wouldn't be able to take the horses and wagon up there. We may have to walk the rest of the way, though. It's not far. It's not far. It's not a long walk. A long walk. And just about a hour and a half, two hour walk. It's only like a twenty minute walk. It'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what he's like? Oh come on! I incite that shit. I, I will accept that shit. shit. Man, I could deceive everyone. <laughs> could you? I could. I got some charm all of you. I rolled a fourteen. Okay, I got, I got a, a twenty-one. Are you right. kidding me? You know he's lying. All right, fine. It's an hour. I, Whatever. I didn't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> I gave up on my own line. <laughs> I'm trying to work on not lying to you guys. That's that's my argument for that. <laughs> okay. It'll be like an hour. It's not. Oh, it's okay. not too bad. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. It's an fine. hour. Yeah. You said it was a short distance. That's not a long distance. It is to some who don't have a lot of time. It could be two hours, but it's only one. <laughs> and an hour back. <laughs> <laughs> if only. <laughs> If only we had someone who could turn into a horse. <laughs> <laughs> this wasn't the deal. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, dude. Where's Ryan's voice at, man? Figure yourself out. It was a joke. <laughs> it's been a while, though. Say a sentence. I just start running down the path. Okay. 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 It'll be off the path. Right yeah, oh, okay. I, I park the yeah. cart and I just start running. Follow me! And also, um, can you guys roll a perception check? A 19. A dirty 20. 24. Uh, all of you see the faint uh, <laughs> faint bootprints, two sets of them. One coming from the mountain, and then two going along the path. I knew she was stealthy. That's cool. Can I, <laughs> can I tr- investigate these bootprints? Sure. Looks like we have company. Not 20! Is there a blizzard? Oh! Nice, you got a name drop. <laughs> <laughs> that joke needed to die! Let it go! So, uh, what did we name this podcast again? <laughs> Unnatural 20. Dirty 20. Let's Ooh. just continue on with the first one. That's what we should call it on Valentine's Day. That's, that's the spinoff. No, Valentine's Day is date night. D8 uh, night. Oh, oh yeah. Right. Nice. Kill me now. <laughs> <laughs> Not only Stay will I be alone for on Valentine's, Valentine's Day. Day. Not only, will I, <laughs> not only will I be forever alone on Valentine's Day, I have to play a fucking campaign called Date Night. I don't want to be a part of it. Do we have to romance each other? No, no, yeah, we're actually just going to sit down and play uh, a Dream Daddy together. All right. Okay, anyway. That's so just a gaming channel. <laughs> <laughs> Since I fucking just added it. Hey, guys, welcome back to my channel. Please like this and subscribe. This is your channel. <laughs> Make sure to hit that like button. Like <laughs> button. Please subscribe. Oh, God. Please subscribe. <laughs> Remember to ring the bell. Ring the bell. Please, my parents hate me. <laughs> I want to move out of my mom's basement. <laughs> if I don't become successful soon, I'm done for. Oh, my God. They won't even subscribe because they don't know what YouTube is. This got way off topic. <laughs> yeah. anyway, I those... do have Venmo. <clears throat> anyway. Yes, so these uh, boot tracks that so I discovered. So, with the Internet 20, you immediately recognize... Like, uh... Um, Passenger's boots. <laughs> hey, <I'm his> <laughs> even, even though there's, like, snow on top of it, you can still realize this it, This seems to be Farron's boot prints. Oh. The one oh. coming from the mountain. The tracks of a human. <laughs> <laughs> I smell that blush. <laughs> <laughs> you guys! You guys! I recognize this. This is Farron. Farron's somebody on his path. 
How do you know the ferret's oh, tracks? I don't believe you. Because I rolled a natural twenty. <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay. What do you mean you don't believe me? Why would I lie? So that echo going on here. <laughs> Maybe because you just want us to go to the cave even more. <laughs> I mean, the, the blueprints are coming from like the mountain, not towards. Yeah, it's even. If I was gonna say that, I wouldn't even take us to the cave. I would take us down this. Why are there two sets of footprints? I don't know because there's another guy. Who is it? I don't know fucking everybody's Well, you knew the first one. Yeah, because it's fairies. Maybe. Well, let's go. Fuck Maybe he has a girlfriend or boyfriend or significant other. Isn't he like a half giant or whatever? Yeah, uh, yeah. if your fur bogs are like around seven feet tall. It's not so big feet. Can I d- t- discern that it's a, uh, yeah, it's a giant footprint clean? Okay, whatever. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to this cave. I turn around and Who are we going to follow the, the footprints? Who's Listen, following? I'll meet up with you later then. Who are we going to leave with the cart? Like, following the ones going, like, down the road? Okay. okay. Sarah does can stay with the cart. No, wait, do you want to come to the cave? Yeah. We can leave him at the cart. If we all just run, he's going to stay. Last one exit has to stay! Can you take the cart down the road? Following the footprints? No, we're not. We're he he could, yeah. That would give him the first prints yeah. go along the road. Oh, okay. Yeah. Fine, you meet up with them, and I'll make my way down to height after this. How old are these footprints? Uh, they seem to have been probably around a day ago. Mm. Uh, Maybe a little bit less. Someone better go a place and make sure he doesn't die. There's those coming. Is coming oh, to place. Right. Yeah. Do oh, someone yeah. better. Someone good better. <laughs> <laughs> I got nothing against Z Man. <laughs> sounds like you do. <laughs> no, it's just he's all right. Um. <laughs> all right, Z Man. Looks like it's you and me. Anyone else coming to the cave? It's just me, Lovecraft, and Zethor. Zethor. <laughs> Why can't I get it right? Damn it. Um. I'm not going. Yeah, I want to go to Ike. Well, um, I can't wait to hang out with this NPC. <laughs> I keep saying Ike. 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 Yikes. So uh, you are you going to Ike? I'm going. Yeah. I'm following the footprints. Okay. Yeah, we'll take the cart. Okay, Spring the party again. <laughs> <laughs> fun, fun. fun. <laughs> Uh, maybe, so, we now maybe we should all split up individually. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> like, let's split up, gang. <laughs> uh, I'll start with Blaze and Zerthos. So you're able to climb up the mountain. There's a small path that you can follow, and eventually you do see there's. Uh, you're also following the footprints, and you see that the footprints stop at a cliff that's overhanging and. Oh, no, that's where the cave is. So eventually you come to this cave, and it's a cliff over top. Okay. I would like to enter said cave, okay. if possible. Yeah, you and Zerthos and Lovecraft all enter, and you recognize this is the cave you were in before. I knew it! And as you look around, you see that on the wall is the same uh, image you remember seen before. And it's of, like, a goddess lady with, like, fantastic weapons in her hands and on her back. A flowing cape, and uh, she seems to be facing the uh, the other direction, like towards the landslide. And Wait. you see a big lands- landslide covering the entire cave, but you do see a hole that has been tunneled through. Excellent, excellent. I'll turn to Zeratos and ask him. Uh, have, have you ever seen stuff like this too with your master visions? I have not. Uh, I don't recognize this at all. I've never seen a depiction of this woman ever. And you said when I visited this place, I didn't get to stay long, right? No, like about a min- minute after you entered the cave, it started. Right. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to go around and, and inspect it. Okay, are you going through the tunnel right now, or just... Uh, well, you said this is the open chamber, right? Yeah. I'll, ch- I'll ex- explore this real quick. <clears throat> okay, so, uh, as you investigate more, you do notice there are a few ruins on this painting as well. And, uh, what languages do you speak? Common, Draconic, Primordial, Dwarvish, and Celestial. You do seem to believe these are Celestial ruins, but they seem to be very, very old Celestial ruins. Right. So you're unable to actually determine what they say. Can I not, like, partially transcribe? No. Really? Yeah. Fuck, the that's the language I learned. <laughs> you're pointless, Celestial. <clears throat> <laughs> but you do recognize it as like a wooden celestial. Okay. Uh, then I guess I can. If I can't read them, 
I'll just scrawl some notes about them and then I'll lead it on through the tunnel again. Okay. No point in sticking around if I can't even fucking read them. Yeah. So. so you come into this other chamber, the other side of the chamber. Uh, you see on the one wall there's the rest of the depiction of the image, which you didn't see much of before. It's of like a demon and devil like army, all with different weapons or magic and. Uh, they all seem angry and are facing towards where the woman was. Can I roll a history check? See if I recognize that from any, like, myths or... Sure. Uh, 21. Uh, you've never seen, like, you've never heard of who that woman was, and, uh, you've never heard her depicted in any other scenes or anything like that. Do I recognize the army at all? The army just seems like an army of the depths or under dark. Oh, so probably the Shardana. No. No, not at all. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. There was that dude downstairs talking about like that great evil army underneath. Yeah. Okay. So it seems similar to that. Okay. So there's a woman and this army's trying to destroy her basically. Yeah. Okay. Uh I relay that to Zerathos. Okay. Hey! Little master visions about a great army rising up from the depths to destroy a, a regal, probably a celestial woman. No, nothing at all. Just us. Just just all the stuff we've done. Yeah, pretty much. Weird. You're, you're the fucking son, weird. The son, son, like, I only met the master, I think it was half a year ago. Alright, well, if anything rings a bell, let me know. Of course. Um, what else is in this one, this chamber? Uh, there are two chambers branching off. Right. One to the right, one to the left. I'm going to the right. To the right? Okay. Yeah, so in this right chamber, you see it's basically a shrine, and it seems to be dedicated to this woman you saw before. Right. So there are mur- mur- murals showing her beauty and power in different fights. She has wep- different weapons in most of these. She seems extremely powerful. And roll a perception check. Or investigation. Investigation? Uh, 17. Uh, you know what's the symbol of Hephaestus on the f- the all the weapons in these images? Okay. And I, I, I would know who that is, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the god of Forge. Yeah, I would fucking think so. Yeah. Uh, so the amazing. name of Hephaestus is scrolled in this chamber with a woman <clears throat> god. Is it, it's not the name of Hephaestus, it's the like symbol the of symbol Hephaestus. Hephaestus. Yeah. And you notice in the very center there's like a sculpture that's holding up like a pristine golden bowl. And there are no coins inside the bowl. Can I inspect said bowl? Sure. And also do a, another perception <clears throat> check as well while you're in here. Uh, 24. You notice there are this, uh, barren spook prints in here as well. Uh, oh, little scuff marks. Uh, I think I turned to Zerathos. I think Farron was exploring in here as well before. Farron is your, um, uh, he's your sorcerer, sorcerer friend. friend, right? Yeah, the one with the mask. Oh, okay. <laughs> My boyfriend. <laughs> he, he, must have, he must have seen this too. Surprised how fast he got here. Yeah, there's no way he could have got here yeah. before us. Seems odd to me. Yeah. We'll but we, we can figure that out when we find yeah, exactly. yeah. Oh, and the, 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 the bowl. I'll, I'll yeah. Uh, so it up? Is it like stuck to a thing? Or? Yeah, it's stuck on it. There's probably oh. still water in there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, there's a bit of water in it. In it. There's no coins in it at all. Blazes across his arms. And he's like, Baron. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to like scoop the water out. Get rid okay. of it. Uh, and you notice that the sculpture holding like, it up seems to be of nine coins stacked. You should let Lovecraft Nicole. drink the water out. Uh, can I put nine coins exactly in there? Sure. Anything happen? Nope. No. Okay, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, do I know anything about rituals like this? Uh, it seems like somewhere where that is, is dedicated for like prayer and stuff like that. Symbol Hephaestus. Prayer. Bowl. So it's, it's like an offering bowl. Kind of, yeah. Uh, can I put my obsidian knife in it? Sure. Nothing, still? Nothing. I turn to Zerathos and say, Any ideas? What? It's clearly it's an offering and there must be something that happens. You gotta put it in it. I know, I, I was thinking about what you were thinking about the coins, but... Didn't seem to work at all. It's held up by nine coins. What kind of coins? 
Uh, you're unable to see like the top and bottom of each coin. You're only able to see that it it like the edge around its comforts. Oh, so I don't know what type of coins they are. No, they seem. Uh, do a history check. Twelve. They seem very old. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! They're really old. <laughs> About ten like, years. Plus so. ten. I rolled a two. It's brutal. Uh, That's a tough one. Damn! I want to figure out this bowl. It's a tough goal. What else is on the walls? Anything to hint towards the bowl? Anything to hint towards her name? No, nothing. No. Uh, well, there are a few celestial ruins on it, but like, well, old and celestial. But you can't determine what they say. Okay. I do have a feet as a background. And you notice that each one has a tree is welding a different weapon or item. So one you see that she has a blackened staff with like uh bailer horns on it. Now there seems to be like a ice spear. And then uh a ha a mighty hammer, like war hammer. Okay, uh, so there's a different cape. Where she's flying, and uh, I have to look at the other stuff. Okay, so clearly there's powerful weapons and gear. Oh man, I really wish I could figure out what to put in this fucking bowl. Mm, what? Yeah. Actually, that's a good idea. I might try that. Sacrifice. <clears throat> yeah, I will. You I'll also see it. one where she's playing a harp. You see one with the necklace, and one with the longbow, and, a clo- and one with the cloak. Do I recognize any of those? They seem just like either powerful weapons or like pristinely made items. Right, 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 right. right. And all of them, you notice, have the symbol of Hephaestus somewhere on them. Items crafted by Hephaestus, essentially, is what I'm coming to. Mm-hmm. Um, and a cloak. A cloak. Uh, I will cut my hand, and I'll, 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 I'll. I don't fucking know. I'll drop some blood in that bowl. Nothing happens. Fuck that hurt. Really <laughs> <laughs> like, grab the bowl and shake it. What do I do? <laughs> <laughs> what do you want from me? And Zerthos is just looking at the different uh, murals and paintings all around. Right. Any ideas there, Zerthos? Any anything you can see? No clue. Oh. Uh, just seems like this woman was extremely powerful, and it's weird that no idea who this could be. Extremely powerful, but her fucking cave is confusing as hell. How many different paintings are there of her? Uh, there are nine of them. So much with the number nine. Nine coins, nine paintings. I'm gonna put nine drops of blood! <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I don't know. Like I'm gonna try nine of each type of coin. Do nine silver, nine copper, and nine electrum. Nothing else. Nothing. God damn it! What the hell? Spicy <laughs> baby. Nothing is supposed to happen. Just determine an insight check. Or roll an insight check. Always gonna feel comfort. I'm not fucking leaving until we get this bull figured out, there Those. Fuck. Never mind. We fucking came in. Oh. Seven. <laughs> you believe that. You might not have what is needed for this bowl. If only you had like a cleric of Hephaestus with you or something. Yeah, if yeah. only he had come. Too bad he's... If only he didn't have to follow his character and go find his friend. If only he didn't have to make the character that way. But whatever. The point is, uh, he probably wouldn't know anyway. Uh, I guess uh, there's nothing of interest or value around in the thing at all. No. I guess I can just... To do. Okay, uh, give me, tell me what items it was again. Uh, let's see. So there was black and staff, staff. Uh, black and staff with Baylor horns, ice spear, war hammer, ice spear, war hammer, cape. What's it? What's it? War hammer, cape. There's a harp, right? Yeah, yeah. harp, longbow, and necklace. Longbow, necklace, and a cloak. Yeah, and a cloak, and a cloak. So nine. I missed one. Staff with bale horns, ice spear, warhammer, cape, longbow, necklace, cloak. Start at eight. One, two, three. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. It's only seven. Seven? Yeah, there's two I hadn't actually thought of yet. Uh, 
So the other one... Uh, yeah, the staff, ice spear, warhammer, cape, longbow, necklace, cloak. Uh, scepter. The other one, so you don't actually notice what's on the... in the in pictures. Is it like faded? No, you just don't notice exactly what it is. You it's don't have a premium <laughs> access account? Oh, harp. I forgot to write harp, so I have eight. There's only one missing one. Okay. Because you said harp. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> you didn't pay for the membership. Man, that is so obnoxious. Okay, I guess... Uh, Swipe your key fob at the entrance. Uh, so there is a ritual bowl that requires an offering that we and don't have. I'll go to you, the, those of you who are walking towards Ike. You didn't get the pre-order bonus. <laughs> no, they're wagoning there, aren't they? Are you guys taking the wagon? Yeah, we take the wagon. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> Yeah, so it. you're following these footprints, and they seem to be leading exactly where you're headed to. Mm-hmm. And you, you notice that one of the footprints, or one of the sets, is of like is a large footprint. And then it turns into a horse. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's a lot of oh, stuff shit. marks in the snow, and then <laughs> continues on. Um, Yikes. All right. You, we, are we going fast? Are we making haste? I am driving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to drive. <laughs> sucks to suck. <laughs> Fight me for it. <laughs> I don't care. I'm in the back. Driving in the back. Yeah, I think I made that joke. Yeah, yeah. well, it's so good though. Cool. So whichever one of you is driving, uh, you just drive in the park, following these oh, prints. Okay. Sixteen. <laughs> yeah, all right. You fucking cheater. Yeah, so you're driving the cart. All right. All right. I'm going super duper stupid fast. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just roll either a vehicle roll or I don't know. Wow. Yeah, you're actually going pretty damn fast. Nice. All right. I'm, I'm just following the footprints. Yeah, and you uh, like the further you get. Uh, it seems like there's less and less snow covering the prints. Cool. Hell yeah. And again, you don't really see many animals of any kind on either side or in the mountains whatsoever. You might see a bear every once in a while, like way off in the distance, or a mountain goat, or maybe elk, or something like that. But it's really not much. Right. Maybe the, the occasional birds, too. You lads better hold on pretty tight because I'm not stopping for anything. <laughs> I take out my rope and I. <laughs> 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 um, <clears throat> yeah, I'm just gonna hold on really tight. Okay. okay. And I'm near the exit, that's for usual. <laughs> it's, my, it's my spot now. Um, yeah, I'm just holding on and I just say, uh, um, all right, that sounds good with me. Okay. Okay. Uh, then I'll go to you, there next. So you're still traveling. Was there anything specifically specific you wanted to do while you're traveling, or ask, or anything like that? Um. No, I don't okay. think so. I okay. probably just get to know Fazmir more. Okay. Yeah. So. No more about his yeah, style, who he is, his motives. Yeah, he tells you that that basically he's just up for revenge against this dragon, and uh, he says, "Once we kill this thing, I don't actually know where I'll go." Uh, how do you feel about liars? Liars. Uh, yes. I prefer people not to lie. They sound nice. But say someone was lying. Say you ran into some stranger in the city and uh, you asked him for directions and he gave you the wrong address. How would you take that? I'd be annoyed at him. Okay. I wouldn't go out for him or anything, but I'd, I'd be annoyed. I'd control while you slept. <laughs> oh. <laughs> slips a tongue and slurs a throat. Colombian necktie. Just curious. <laughs> Is there anyone specific you're hinting about? 
by saying this? Me? Yes. Um, are you the liar? No. <laughs> Negatory. I was just simply proposing an idea. I ran into the same situation when I was in my travels. I see. I handled it a little... I handled it in a different way. I was just curious of your thoughts. Like in a... How... In what way would you say? I turned into dust. Yeah, I'd say that's not the greatest. Uh, What did this person do to you? He lied to me. (laughs) That's why I was asking you. I don't know if my actions were over dramatic or over the top. In my opinion, that might be a bit over the top. I will adjust for next time. (laughs) (laughs) For next time. I do that. (laughs) Well, we all make mistakes. (laughs) Beautiful day, though. (laughs) Beautiful day. Uh, After a while, you're getting really close to the edge of uh, height. Uh, Fazmir set didn't really want to stop and dress just to get to height as fa- soon as possible. That's fine. You're also really getting close to freaking them out. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and eventually you, you hear the sound of galloping way oh. off behind you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I whip around. What do I see? Does you see a carriage? I whip a I whip a fireball horse. at it. <laughs> what? Yeah. No, you don't. I do. With oh, two my. horses in front, but then you see a rider on top of one of the horses. You can't make out who it is. Oh, it, not it's fireball, off in the distance, so probably like uh, kilometer away, maybe yeah, two no, away. I didn't mean fireball. I meant uh, thunderbolt. Oh my, oh my god. <laughs> Good thing the range on that is not that far. I'm going to use extended spell or distance spell. Yo, what? you should not and do double this. the range. You better not kill hey, a fucking what, What's what are you using? I'm Can using I... lightning bolt. Can I see it? Oh, lightning bolt. Yeah, it's a third level spell. <laughs> Jesus fuck, man. Would I be able to make out? Its range is 100 feet. And yeah, yeah so you can only go 200 feet, which is very deep. far off. Oh, so. Probably not. You do see it that it's two people, one larger than the other. How far is it? uh, Pretty safe to assume. Yeah, you could probably assume it. Okay. What did you say, sir? How far is the cart? It's about a kilometer away. In feet. Uh, I can Google it. 1,000 meters, about 3,000 feet. 3,000 feet? (laughs) Yeah, roughly. Okay, never mind then. I will prepare, however, to shock the cart. Okay. (laughs) <laughs> so it's about 6,560 I thought it was feet. a lot closer. Okay, but yeah. Okay. It's actually amazing you can see that. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's like at I don't more like that. top. He's like at a higher elevation than going that. I'm yeah, I'm going to crack s- a few jokes. Yeah. I'm just going to stop, whip around, and have my hands sparking with lightning hey, ready to cast. Why do you edge all the time, man? Maybe a strange a- car comes racing behind Maybe me. they're just going with the ice. <laughs> Yeah, fuck, man. They're just traitors. You don't meet a lot of people in this area. Yeah, that's fair. All right. All right. I'll go back to Blaze. And it's me. Yes. I'm going to go to the next chamber. Okay. Let's go to the next one, Zarathos. There's nothing we can do with this bow. Sounds good. And... (laughs) He's like, yeah, okay. And Lovecraft (laughs) says, all right. (laughs) I've learned to speak. (laughs) I am alive and well. Thank you for asking. (laughs) My name is Lovecraft. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> bark, bark, bark. <laughs> I like no. barking. I haven't released any of those episodes yet, so no one has to know the episode. <laughs> All right. That's fine. Stay tuned for our randomized quest. Ba, ba, ba. Yeah, so uh, you go into this left chamber, and as you enter, you hear the sound of like water hitting a, another body of water. Is that Farron again? Casting his damn spells? And as you get closer, you see that there are nine statues all around the room, and then one statue of the same woman in the center in a fountain. And there's water filling the fountain, and there's water coming out of all the statues' hands into the fountain. Not one drop has hit the floor. So there's nine statues? Yeah. Around her? Uh, Do I know who the statues are of? Uh, you do not. You're really? F- yeah. Can I water. assume they're deities? Uh, roll a... 
either investigation or history check. Oh, I know which one I'm picking. <laughs> investigation, clearly. Yeah, obviously. Uh, 28. 28? Yeah, so... Give it to me, boy. <laughs> Come on, man. This is my only redeeming How's quality. Plus 10? <laughs> You've seen... Double proficiency. You've Would seen statues like this before, mm-hmm. no. and... You would be safe to assume that there's some kind of god. As well as the one in the center. So there are nine gods surrounding one clearly a very important deity. Okay, uh, anything else I can take of notice in this chamber? Uh, can I inspect the water and stuff? Uh, yeah, so you inspect the water and you feel that if you take any out, and try to smash it, it won't even hit the ground. Okay, that's fucking creepy. And you notice that the uh, fountain never overflows, and it seems like it never could. You also see that each of the statues has a slight glow above it, like trying down on it. Each a different color. That's great. What colors? Uh, so, left to right. Left is kind of like a... Uh, Kind of like a darker yellow-ish. Next is... Uh, next... So I'm going around in a circle like this. So left, then right. clockwise. Awesome. Okay. Then... Uh, blue. Then a uh, lighter blue. Then... Kind of... Um, uh, gr- green, I guess. Then... Uh, a dark blue... Black, the lightest light you've ever seen. Then, I guess, I guess green would be this next one as well, but like a vibrant green. And then, uh, orange. I think I go with the orange one. Okay. Uh, this one you notice is a statue of a woman. A woman? Yeah. Okay. Is she holding one of those weapons from the other room? Uh, let's see. Yes, uh, down at, at her side. Seems to be the staff with the devil, with the baylor horns on top. Right, okay. So, these weapons this woman was holding were weapons she gave to her underlings. Okay. Uh, which one is holding the, uh, which one please, like, most? Um... <clears throat> the spear. Which one's holding the ice spear? That is the third one from the left. The light blue one? Okay. Yep. Um, anything? Is that a woman as well? Or? Yep. Okay. Any notable features? Uh, she kind of has... Uh, her hair seems to be... Uh, Intricate and almost shiny in the light. Hell oh, yeah. See. Okay. Shiny hair light. So, I'm going to assume these are all primordial deities. For the most part. And they all answer to this one powerful goddess. They're her weapons of some sort. Okay. It's Zelda. Okay. <laughs> uh, is there anyone I think would closely resemble Hephaestus? Uh, Hephaestus maybe the one with the hammer? None of them look like what you've seen Hephaestus to look like in like ancient scrolls or anything like that. Right, but clearly Hephaestus made these weapons. You'd be... You could probably assume so. Yeah. <laughs> if only you decided to come. If only I didn't have to follow my character. <laughs> Okay, that's that's cool. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna I'm gonna draw the the chamber. Okay, I'm gonna do my best because I know Ryan will know more. Yeah. As soon as you tell me about this place, I'm gonna want to go there. Too late. I'm going there. Okay, but I'm gonna I'm gonna draw the chamber. I'm gonna draw all the weapons. I'm gonna draw this woman. I'm gonna draw all the gods individually. It's gonna take me a while, but yeah, I'm gonna draw it all out. I want to get a good detail of it. Okay. Uh, Zarathos is just looking at, at the different statues as well, and we'll. Uh, look at the one, the fountain. He doesn't really know anything about any of them, though. How do these look like the master? Again, uh, when I saw the master the first time, it looked like one of my best friends at the time, so... 
Go to the one that's... There's one holding the harp, right? Yeah. Actually, if there's nine statues, you're each holding a weapon. Uh, what's the ninth one, then? Uh, you don't see a weapon in your hand. Uh, roll an uh, investigation now, actually. It's been stolen. Oh my fucking god, with this investigation <laughs> bullshit. Fucking five. Five. You're unable to determine what it is. Pissing me off. That's what pissing me off. Initially, I didn't actually have something for what they were holding, oh. but I have something now. Oh, okay. Well, that's fucking annoying. Okay. Damn, uh, that's what he's doing. Stupid. I hate when rolls do that. Okay. Uh, I don't know then. Uh, I'm going to go the one with the harp, because this is okay. a bard I'm with. He got visited by somebody called the Master. Yeah, uh, Zerthos is like I've done the most. That's what I figured. Ring any bells, this harp? Uh, I have to look at which one. I think I know which one this is. Yeah, so this is a uh, male deity, or what do you assume is a deity? And the harp seems very intricately made. It has the symbol of vessels on it as well. Uh, Zerthos does not recognize anything specific about the statue. Like, he hasn't ever seen this one before either. Uh, yeah, he just says how nice the harp looks and stuff like that. I'm really glad you came along. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I just teased him. But, uh... I am salty about that three. I can't lie. I won't lie to you. Okay, uh... There's nothing really here for us then, I guess. It's fucking... Oh, crap. Insane. But yeah, I'm gonna take my time. I'm gonna draw those pictures. And then I guess Zarathos and I will leave. Okay. And I guess fucking walk tight. <laughs> Jerks. <laughs> hey, there, is, there is nothing else. Right? Yeah, you haven't noticed anything else. Yeah. I'll go back to you, you guys. So you guys are uh, going full steam ahead towards <laughs> Farron. And Farron, they're now close enough that you're able to actually see Ryan on one of the horses. Can Cast I fireball. <laughs> Can I use thaumaturgy and make my voice real loud? Sure. Okay. And I'm like, Fat and worse out, you son of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> you Yikes. Yeah, I'll just I'll stop my little shocky shocks. Alright, alright. Oh. I keep going full bore. How do they get here? Full horse. <sighs> Keep Horse forgetting power. to have you roll for wild magic. Yeah. Wild magic and my yeah. other thing. So you've used magic like two or three times now. This, this yeah. Is, uh... Okay. So, <laughs> anyway. yeah, so you, yeah, you raise your voice and you're able to hear that. Oh, how did they get here? So fast. <laughs> what? Okay. Um, Fastmere turns towards you and says, Do you know these men? Or this man? Yeah, these are my companions. I thought you were traveling alone. <laughs> see, I kind of lied. I see. <laughs> I wasn't sure if I, I should see. trust you right from the beginning. Should I turn you to dust? <laughs> <laughs> I oh, can't. I can't. <laughs> dust! <laughs> <laughs> I like your thought. Well, you I become just... more suspicious. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. How long have you, have you been traveling with them? No. How long roughly was it? It's yeah. probably been like yeah, almost a month, I think. A full year. <laughs> well, probably. Yeah. Well, honestly, I have no sense of time right now. Yeah. It could be about a month, or it could be like no, about a month. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, did you just ditch them, or no? Not a, well. Yeah, I guess. <clears throat> You, you know what? Let's say, yeah, I did. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't think you even need to roll inside. You just know he's <laughs> fucking lying after that. Yeah. Why's that? Hmm. I saw a mountain. <laughs> I saw a mountain. <laughs> Honestly, I was kind of forced over here. Very confused. I don't know if it's been three years or a month. I don't know. We're about to find out once I see <laughs> Ryan. <laughs> It's been 34 years! <laughs> <laughs> Where the fuck have you been? <laughs> oh my god, do we know that he's really bad with time? Like, do I know that? Uh, I don't know. No, you what have I no clue know? that I... I oh, I'm totally confused. Yeah. I don't know where I am. Yeah. I don't have a sense of time. Because I just kind of showed up. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, what the fuck would he 
I'm so bad. <laughs> I haven't seen her for six years. <laughs> you just disappeared one day. <clears throat> Yeah, have we reached them yet? Yeah, you reached them. Okay, right. I pull back on the reins and like make the horses rear up and stop. And I jump off the cart before it even stops moving. <laughs> grab Farron in a bear hug, pick him up, spin him around, put him down, and then I punch him in the face. <laughs> 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 How many checks is that? <laughs> yeah, okay, you can only do one action per turn. Uh, just, All right, you know what? Roll yeah. the grapple, roll the hit. <laughs> Bonus action. I'm just gonna be too shocked by it, yeah. so yeah. I'd say you're equal to. Yes. <laughs> say that's yeah. Where the fuck have you been? Yes. Uh, no. Well, it's good to see you too. It's been a while. <laughs> um I've been up on that mountain and then in a cave. Uh-huh. And now I'm walking with this fine gentleman over there. Yes, hello, I'm and the psychopath. Talk and I like hop out of the back of the car and I walk over to him. We go to mall. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> also, my face hurts slightly, but I'll ignore that. Good. How did you get here? Well, um, I don't know quite exactly. I kind of showed up at the top of that mountain peak over there. Uh, I had a very strange dream I do not want to experience again. All right. Ryan, I thought you said you knew where he went. I was lying all the time. <laughs> you bastard. Now, this party is not true. For me. <laughs> the top of the mountain was like burnt, right, when I woke up? Uh, it wasn't the very top. It was near the top, but near. like it was at a small plateau. But the area uh, was... Which, yeah, burnt. it was all burnt when you woke up, like a 50-foot radius. Yeah, I spent the third time this has happened now. I, I woke up, and the whole area around me was burnt as if hit by the sun. All right, that's a little concerning. I'm not gonna lie. I'm very concerned, but uh, I don't know what's going on. The third time this has happened. So I met this lovely gentleman, Fazimir, and uh, we're off to you slay a dragon. A, horse and, uh, a dragon. A dragon. A dragon. Yes. Would well, you like to join us? Are we are strong got... enough to kill a dragon? If you guys, how big is this dragon? If you guys agree to fight a fucking dragon, if you guys agree to fight a dragon, I'm gonna be so pissed because you're gonna go to the fucking cave with me to fight a dragon. Of course, I'm gonna fight a dragon. This is a an adult black dragon. He killed everyone I know uh, a few months ago. For that, <laughs> including children. Many children died. Many parents died. Obviously, we're doing this. He just made I my entire village. <laughs> this thing needs to die. I agree. All right, you guys are a bunch of ass. Nice. <laughs> 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 Fucking ditch me in a cave with hey, no way to get back. I didn't ditch you. I just wanted to go find Farron. You ditched me. <laughs> well, you said you wanted to go check out the cave. You took a cart. I, I had the choice between going cart. to a cave you visited once on All your right. training or going to find my friend Farron. So what? Chose her. Hey! <laughs> Guys, we need to stop Artemis. Oh, yeah, it's fine. I we'll guess that's that. kind of what I started doing. I put it off See, when I get bippity bop somewhere, I kind of just figure I have to find something new. <laughs> sure. I would appreciate the help if you guys would help me fight this dragon. I already promised I would help yes, you. Yes, I believe that it's somewhere in the mountains near I. Hey, so there's some, a wizard around here, supposedly, that um, we need to find anyway. Hold on, where's Blaze? He went off to find a cave. Of course he did. He said it was one he visited when he was training, I think, and they caved in and he couldn't get in, but I wonder if it was going back. I wonder if it was the same cave I went in. Was it, um, I guess you wouldn't know, you didn't seem like you've went in there. No, that was a cave I went in, it had some shrines, um... About gods and things. I think gods, I don't know. Powerful beings. Mm-hmm. A lot of rubble, though. I had to clear it out. Um, yeah, that's pretty much the gist of it. <laughs> There's a one word you have to say. <laughs> <laughs> one word you have to say. Hold on, I have a general here. Let me All look right. at my general. Alright, I'm, I'm interested. It's been a little bit since I've been there. Um, <laughs> yeah, from what I could gather, there was a powerful woman. She seemed to be in a battle with uh, the demons. <laughs> and she carried a lot of weapons on her. They had a, a symbol 
Uh-huh. I depicted that symbol was a hammer and an anvil. It related to a man named Hephaestus. A oh, hammer and anvil. <laughs> oh, yes. Finally, <laughs> drag that shit out. <laughs> That's Hephaestus. literally you saying that as my ticket for a ride. I. I'll say that as anything for you. <laughs> yeah, Hephaestus. I think that was right. And to Hephaestus or a shrine, not to Hephaestus. Hephaestus. Uh, the weapons they had Hephaestus' uh, sigil on. Would be Hephaestus sigh. I don't know. Maybe <laughs> you're gonna get there, and I'll be bleeding out and trying to put more blood in that bowl. <laughs> like, why won't you work? <laughs> yeah, there's many different weapons. There is a staff, a spear, war hammer, cape, cloak. There's harp, longbow, and necklace. Do I have any idea what he's talking about? No, no. Don't forget the staff. All right. I said the fastest. Oh, good job. Proud of you. Wow. Yeah. We should go to this cave. Well, you can go to the cave. I promise this Phasmir over here, I'm going to help him kill that dragon. All right, well, if it's the same cave Blaze went to, we should go pick him up anyway. Because <laughs> then sure. he can come help us kill this dragon. <laughs> yeah, I'll turn him up the ass. <laughs> I kind of want to check out this cave if it's... <clears throat> Got something to do with Festus, because, you know, half the reason I'm on a quest is for Festus, so... Phasmir, <laughs> how far are we from this dragon's lair area? Uh, I don't know exactly where it is, but I'd probably say it's around a day's march from here. Well, it's so close now. But you caught up to us, so you have the wagon. I do have the wagon. Why don't you all go back, pick up Blaze, and then you can meet up with us again. You caught up soon enough. Yeah, that's true. So you can disappear again. Well, no, so I can not ditch Phasmia. Well, I die lonely to a dragon. You guys are heading to Ike, right? It wouldn't be too bad if we just all went back for your friends. Maybe they'd like to help fight this dragon. Too. This dragon destroyed your village. Everyone you know is dead. Yes. And you want to go back? No, it's but I'm like... saying if you got, if you want, we can. The more the merrier. It's like an hour oh, out of the so way. So long. <laughs> Fine. It's an hour. All right, well, <laughs> Fazmir, it's your call. I'm just here to help you. Uh, all right, we'll go back then. I'll join you on the journey. I guess I could use a break. I've been walking for a while. This bear pelt's kind of heavy, but it yeah, looks nice. Yeah, if only you had a horse. If only I had a horse? Yeah. Fazmir! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Fazmir, darling! Oh, I'm trying to shapeshift! How do you feel about being a little bit degraded? I would prefer not to. I mean, more horse, more power. More horsepower. Where the hell are you hiding a horse fast? <laughs> <laughs> what are you going on about? Oh, you guys are idiots. No, he's not hiding hey, a horse. He can I'm turn a into a horse. So I can uh, turn into a Oh, well, that's a little... Degrading. Degrading. Yes. No, no. No, no. Degrading for me, I have to ride a man. <laughs> oh, no, that's, that's, a pretty, that's pretty shady. <laughs> what? Well, that's where you draw the line. <laughs> He's a druid. That was the shady. That's literally just All right, a druid. We know what we're doing. I say you could be spy on us for, as an animal at any point in time. Fast I'm me right up. here with you. <laughs> what do you think, Elrondel? <laughs> I think we should go back. <laughs> All right, sounds good to me. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Fazmir, if you're fine with it, then I'll be okay with it. Oh, you guys pick me up. Yeah, it's be fine. <laughs> I do have a bit of a more pressuring quest I need to be delving myself in so well I'm glad I would join with you I'm pretty sure I thought we were just lost forever after I disappeared six moons ago six how long has it been ago. by the way how long has it been like a week maybe uh it's probably been around five days I think oh, five days five days okay I was just assuming maybe it might have been years I had no I had no clue um Oh, um, sorry, did I say sorry, five did weeks? Did I say days? I meant years. <laughs> I meant five weeks and six years. <laughs> you figure you're probably, like, unconscious for about a day or a day and a half during your vision. Jesus. Or after you appeared in the mountain. Ugh. Was there any sign of him disappearing? Like, did you say there was, like, a mark on the floor? Yeah, so there was a small circle in on the floor where there was no dust or anything, and you detected some kind of transportation okay, okay. magic, but, like, a dark version. Devil magic. Wow. It's like not normal uh, uh, transportation magic, but if it were a dark pit, that'd be his. Instead of oh my god. Okay. <laughs> well, wait, all right. Wait, all right. 
Wait a minute, everyone. Next Hold time. on. I think I know how we can get back faster and save us some time. I have this stone. Oh god. Okay. Uh, no. no right. <laughs> and oh, I immediately don't accept. <laughs> What's it do? I don't know, but I understand from Phasmia it, it does some sort of teleportation, but only to a specific location. Yeah, and you found that in the cave you went to. Yes, tomorrow. yes, it was found right, in the cave. Right. Can I see it? Sure. Okay, I take a gas identify on it. Okay, uh what does what exactly does identify do? You choose Boy. one object. You must touch throughout the casting, which takes a minute. If it's a magic item or some other magic compute object, you learn its properties and how to use them, whether it requires attunement and how many char- charges it has, if any. You learn whether any spells are affecting the item and what they are. If the item was created with a spell, you learn what spell created it. Yeah, uh, you determine that this is a transportation rock mm-hmm. or stone. And you believe it's it can be used once per day, but it can trans uh, transport up to ten people at once. But I don't know where it goes. You could probably incite that it would go somewhere near where the cave is, being that that's where it was found. You guys want to try it? Uh, as long as I get to use it. Yeah, of course. Sir. I'm taking the cart. <laughs> All right, we'll meet you there. <laughs> you also, would that jam that? Holds off water. Would that affect snow? That'd be pretty. Just sick. frozen water, uh, right? Uh, <laughs> can't deny science. You're breaking gauge. the DM's brain now. <laughs> it, it would keep snow off you. It wouldn't keep the cold out. Keep the cold out. Yeah, no. It, what, like, but it would it like probably push, push away the snow. snow ahead of us. Yeah, I, I think it would. It's cool. Like it's not awesome. Yeah, we should just so keep that the cart right now. <laughs> <laughs> Keep the cart there all the time, and the cart just never gets like bothered like by mud or ice or snow. Or, well, ice. So this entire time, you've been making like a a big, huge. a huge path that's just <laughs> free of snow. I don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, shall we? I guess Lazarus I mean, is way. Must like the scenery we'll or something. Meet you there. I, I can stay with Lazarus as well. Or you can just grab them, bring them here quickly, and we can all go at once. <laughs> okay. Yay! We have some talking about dragons to do. <laughs> Fair enough. I you brought two monsters to you, I'll and you, you said no monsters, but whatever. I'm taking the stone back to wherever the stone leads. Please yeah. come back to me, guys. Uh, you ready? <laughs> you didn't have... Yeah, so you believe that no, you just need to shake it three times and this guy knows sport. that there's a dragon okay. here. Alright, here we go. Hopefully Lazarus. this takes us to you. Are you coming with us? You're taking the cart. I'm taking the cart. <laughs> okay, can I sneak up on Lazarus and touch him as soon as we teleport? Uh, I'm going to shake it twice and wait the hurry. Roll a stealth check oh, and you roll an insight check. Oh man, that's not good. I'm not stealthy. It's a nine. I got a six. <laughs> yes! <laughs> yeah. oh, yes! You're coming with us. You're coming with us. Yeah. So, like, I, I turn around from the group and I start walking back towards the carriage. And I guess we teleport. <laughs> <laughs> and I shake it the third time. Okay, but I'm, but I'm not realizing what's happening and I'm just still walking as, right after we teleport. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> so I just left past me with their car. <laughs> No, we brought him with us. Yeah, he should be so coming. Yeah, he's just oh, yeah. Yeah. We just abandoned the cart. Oh, uh, okay. And all the yeah. stuff in the cart. Yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah the cart's just there. Yeah, fine. Fine. Put the cart in the bag of holding. <laughs> God! I already shook it, man. My friends! I don't think we're there yet. So you appear in the... Uh, in the room with the fountain... In the room with the fountain? No. And there, you see nine statues all around you, and oh. you see Blaze sitting, in like on the fountain, just drawing a uh, picture. Which way am I facing? I don't see them. No, this poor fountain. Yeah, I guess he'd be. Let's see. So, do you know what no, you'd be no, facing a wall or statue. Yeah. Wall you wouldn't be facing any of these. I'd walk like oh, another four, four steps yeah. and be yeah, like, I, I'm holding this. Like, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> so, where am I? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I turn around. <laughs> what are you doing here? What I'm in the water. <laughs> he has a stone. Yo, uh, oh my oh. god. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> How did everybody get here? Huh. We come back for you, Blaze. No, you didn't. 
It's a good question. Oh, fuck. <laughs> you <laughs> you just found that was oh, like water that. displays. No, in just, the, just say in the, the magical effects of the room overpower the stone. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, I think nothing would happen. Or we summon an apocalypse. You guys made it! Check it out! Effective. Yeah. Like my cave, I told you about the cave. Oi, what the fuck? Fairs here too! <laughs> and then you see this big fur bog sound of a doll, old man. Hey man, what's up? That's um, the one we brought you here to kill. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! And I run to the chamber with the bowl. Um, <laughs> and Zerthos is just like, oh hey guys. <laughs> Zerthos, he's gonna kill me! <laughs> hey Z, man. Hey, is his name spelled a Z or an X? Uh, Z H E R T H. Show us. Fesmir. That's Blaze. Blaze. I'm Fesmir. I'm already out the room. Okay. Yeah, he's out of the way. I thought this monster could kill me. I'm in the room with the ball. Okay. I'm on my knees. Help me, strange goddess! <laughs> You're so throwing all your shit in the bowl. You're like, please. <laughs> Why won't you accept my money? <laughs> I put nine darts in <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to make my way over to the comforting room. Okay. Ray's just ran okay. I'm totally ignoring all of this now that I've noticed where I am. And I'm just going to investigate. Okay. The when, Hold on. When you're in Nobody room, move. Blaze, when you're in the dark room, all what the fuck is happening? <laughs> Who did this? Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, man. I walk back out. I don't know and why. Then, as you walk out, they start to kind of... Ah! Like a tiny <laughs> Just a tiny bit, though, so, like, they're not coming full strength, but you... Yeah. <laughs> I, go, I go in. Uh, what are you doing, Ryan? I'm just checking out the room. Okay, I grab Ryan by his arm. Oh, hey, what the f- No, trust me, you're gonna like what's in this other room. And I drag him to the room with the bowl. Okay. Look at this, look, 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 look at all this stuff. And I show him all the, the weapons and the walls with the symbols of Hephaestus. I show him the bowl, I show him the coins. Look, look! I'm looking. <laughs> I want to just pray at the thing and see if I feel good again. Okay. All right, all right. Yeah, you, you pray and all your fears just go away. So this is a room with a bowl and nine paintings yep. and a statue of the goddess. Uh, there's no statue no in statue. this room. No. Zeratos and I have... It's come just come. the uh, statue of like the coins holding up the bowl. The okay. now of nine darks in it. Yeah, I take my darts back. Okay. Okay. But that, um, clearly, um, number nine is very important. Uh, everything is linked to Hephaestus. No, I don't know what these deities are. I'm assuming they're deities. The main one is clearly their lord or leader. But uh, the, the bull, it requires a sacrifice. But I don't know if we have what, what we need to put in it. All right. I'll, uh, Do you have anything magical you can put in here? I don't know. Just give me a second to think. I'm just going to try and see um, if I can speak to this deity. Right? Okay. Nine coins for uh, the bull. Pardon? There's nine coins holding out the bowl. Yeah, that's it. Okay. I'm gonna interrupt <coughs> Farron as he's praying. I'm like, <laughs> Farron. <laughs> hey, can I see? Can I see the rock? Why do you want to see the rock? I'm interested to see if it'll take us back to where we teleported from, or if it's only a one-way trip. You notice that the rock has lost its hue. And we left the card. <laughs> it is made. Oh, damn it. <laughs> yeah. It's possible this is only a one time use, but here, and I'll toss the rock to you. Catch it. Um, no, it. Don't interrupt my prayer. <laughs> I'm going to pray again. Okay. I want to feel good. All right, I, I'll leave him. Um, so, do I notice that the hue is gone from before from the rock as well? Or is would, uh, or like It's rock? gone after it was used. Uh, okay. uh, you can assume this is a once per day thing. Um, would I know both ways? Uh, maybe if you waited a day, it might go back to where you came from. You're not exactly sure, though. All right. I guess I'll, I'll hold on to it for now. Um... Yeah, I give that guy the transportation stuff. So. Yeah, <laughs> I, I think the full... I have two stones. <laughs> What's it? Uh, to the devs. Oh. Oh, yeah. And you have the destination dagger. Yes. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> What's with you in teleportation magic? Dude, I don't know. Or to Artemis. Yeah. Yeah, of course, Artemis. Yeah, I, How yeah. could I forget that? Ryan. I had that guy. Ryan! <laughs> what? <laughs> I missed 
fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll pull my armor at you. Oh, thank you. Um, but do, do you know anything about her back? Hephaestus and his we- these weapons. Um, did you, did you hear legends about him creating powerful, mid- like, items? Well, he is the god of blacksmith things. So like yeah, I knew that, things. but I mean, like these specifically. He's, if you want to learn, then stop talking. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> He's created lots of powerful weapons, but I don't know exactly what these are referring to. Um, Gage, can I do like a yeah, religion check? Religion check. Twenty one. Yes. Yeah, so you know that he has created some extremely powerful weapons, like you know he made Mjolnir, which yeah, is yeah. canon in this universe now, because I just oh. said it. Oh. oh, I dig it, I dig it. As well as uh, different weapons that different gods, or like gods, uh, patrons and followers have used to kill like powerful demons and stuff like that. Stormbringer? Is the whole yeah. Greek yeah. pantheon canon in this universe? Like, uh, No, I don't no, think so. Just... Oh, so. There's no Aphrodite? No. <laughs> <laughs> what about like, like Zeus, Apollo, or Zeus, Hades, Poseidon kind of thing? I don't think so. No, not at all. No. Okay, that's cool. Yeah. Just Basically. the sixth most important one, Hephaestus. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but you have never, you haven't heard of any of what any of these weapons look like before. Okay. Uh, I just, I, I, I wanted to mention, I do have a, a feat because of my background called Researcher, where it says, when you attempt to recall or learn a piece of lore, if you do not know that information, I can often know where and from whom I can obtain that information. So, is there anywhere I know of that I can learn more about these places? Or if at least like yeah. where my best chance to learn more about it is. You you have a hint in your mind that says the depths. Oh, I fucking hate this place. <laughs> <laughs> depths again. <clears throat> what about uh the temple of Hephaestus in Sten? Yeah, I, I guess that maybe m- you might be able to find something there about okay. it. All right. It might be a long shot because you have never seen anything about any Sorry, of these the, statues or yeah. these weapons before. Yep. Okay. Oh, man, it sounds like we have to make several return trips to the depths. Well, it's a good thing we have all these teleportation zones, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> and if you wanted, you could roll a uh, investigation check on the stone to, stones and statues to determine how old they are. How about insight? Oh, uh, sure. Why not? 18. Uh, you believe... Uh, because you have Sonic cutting, you have advantage, I think, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 18. 18. <laughs> <laughs> uh, because of your knowledge on stonework, you'd be able to assume that these are over a thousand years old. As well as the painting and fountain. This is an old shrine. Can I go in? Uh, yeah, uh, not, not to sound rude. I gotta figure that part out, though. <laughs> Alright. Can I go into the room with the fountain? Yeah. Is there, like, an altar you can pray at kind of thing? Or? Uh, I was just having a panic attack. <laughs> not so much as an altar, but, like, the fountain would be able to be like that. So you see me trying to wash my face in your <laughs> <laughs> What do you think you're doing? Try to calm down. <laughs> Get out of nice. my swamp! <laughs> Get out of my swamp. Lazarus. <laughs> like the water hits your face and stuff, but none actually hits the ground. Okay. Is there anything on the ground? Uh, no, it's just dirt, like dirt okay. Oh, okay. and stone. Are you really freaking out right now? Not really. Now that I've washed, <laughs> splash cold water on my face. All right, he's gonna do some. There, there's one weapon I, I can't seem to recognize. If you wanna check it out. What is it? No, show me. I don't know what it is. I no, can't recognize. I mean, show me. I took a statue. I, I was trying to inspect before. Okay. I know about lots of weapons. Uh, roll a perception or investigation check. Either one. 
Also, that teleportation was not cool, bro. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, I think it's funny. It was a bro moment. Uh, sorry, what did you say? Investigation or perception? Yep. Yeah. Uh, Thirty twenty. You see a ring on her finger. That's why I couldn't see yeah. it. Okay, fine. I'll let it slide. And it has <laughs> a uh, what's another like blue stone, not a sapphire. Lapis lazuli. Lapis lazuli or sure, amethyst. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you see amethyst it. Lapis lazuli. Some more purple. Okay. Mm. On the ring. No, I had that before. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay. Right. That's the only thing, like specifically, that you notice different than the others. Okay. Right. To, to me, it seems like there are powerful weapons hidden throughout Tanzania, and we have to find them. That's a bit of a leap, but maybe you're right. <laughs> it might give my character purpose. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll see what we can find out. <laughs> we can go to Stan. There's a a temple up to Festus and the the priests, the clerics there might know more. Okay, uh, I would like to go there right now. <laughs> Well, we'll get that eventually. We can add that to the list. Yeah. Fuck me, this list is getting so long! <laughs> right. It's gonna um, give me a fucking stroke! Roll a religion check right now. Mia doesn't even know we're slaying a dragon. Actually, no, you don't need to be rolling. Uh, so, <laughs> you, get a, you get a feeling in your mind, and it's a feeling you've only felt a few times before. You feel it in your bones. You're a The first time was when you <laughs> entered your master's shop for the first time. Second time was when... Uh, the girl was brought to you, brought, brought to your shop. Uh huh. The third time was when he left your shop. All right. Fourth, the le- last time was when you decide to go to Stillsby or Avranches, and it's always been a feeling of knowing exactly where you need to go. And I'm feeling it now. You are. Okay. I'm feeling. You feel it going like really the opposite direction of the road. This is the middle of town. Like back the way we came, kind of thing, or no? So like the road <clears throat> to your east, so you're feeling it towards the northwest. Oh, okay, okay. So away from light. The same sense I felt before. Yeah, you felt it so much. You mm-hmm. felt you feel it like a brick of hammers. Holy shit. <laughs> Break of hammers. What yeah. the fuck? <laughs> 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 what? No one questioned you. I was like, that's a really heavy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I questioned it. I was like, thinking it in my head. Break of hammers. And I was like, something feels awesome. <laughs> a wall of bricks? Uh, yeah. yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> Brick of hammers. A bag of hammers. Bricks. <laughs> <laughs> you just got punched in the fucking face with some knowledge, my man. <laughs> Listen, there's nothing more powerful than knowledge. I'm Ty Lopez at this is point. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Take my second seven bookshelves. Yeah, I put bookshelves in my garage yeah. next to my Lamborghini. Break my hammers. Hammers. Spruce. <laughs> Spruce. <laughs> yeah. All right. So I know we need to go there, but I don't know why. It doesn't. Do you know what's why in that direction? That no. Okay. What's in that direction? Uh, it's another mountain. Do I still feel that? Maybe it's. Oh, uh, you feel it really faintly. <clears throat> but well, I guess now that you're back here, you do feel it again. Okay. But not like a brick fabric. <laughs> do you do you relay that? I do. Uh, like do I know anything about that section of the mountains? Uh, you've investigated some of the mountains there, but you've never found you never found something of major significance. There's a dragon. So you, you said that to everyone in the group? Yeah, I'll tell everybody. Fazmir says that's not a good way to go. Why not? Uh Farron was telling me you guys went to the depths before. Yeah. Yeah. That's where another way into the depths is. Is there what? I've I've investigated that part of the land before. I never found an entrance to the depths. Probably just weren't looking in the right places. Probably had your eyes closed. Why do you know where it is? (laughs) I stumbled across it a a couple months ago while traveling here. Alone? Yes. Or I guess a month ago now. Alright. Can you show us? Yes. <sighs> but we have to kill that dragon for you first. I yes. Guess. I would appreciate it. Of course. Of course. Of course. We can... A deal's a deal. We need, need to... You... <laughs> <laughs> we need to save those people from Avranches. I'm going to start following that <laughs> sense. No, okay. Right. Right. Yeah. And going in that direction to the northwest. You're going to have to leave the cave first. I know. Okay. I'm just walking down that path. You're just what do we want to do? Already? You're going right yeah. now? Yeah. By yourself? Uh-huh. Okay, hold up! 
Oh, you're you going away. <laughs> you're gone. Uh, Wait, before he... Uh, oh, fuck's sake. Okay, whoop, he's a, he can't go far. He's I'm got following him. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> Listen, we got so... Okay, we can either go to the mountain for the depths, we can go fight this dragon, we can go to I look for the wizard, or we can go to Chun and fight uh, Artemis. Or, like, there's four different options. And that's where we <laughs> leave off on this episode. Okay! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man.